Hi, I'm Ryan with Convert Solar. So you've got your net meter. Now it's time to turn your system on and start producing power and saving money. This video is going to show you uh, the location of all your switches, how to turn all your switches on, how to make sure all your switches are in the on position, and also how to, how to tell if your inverter is producing power by viewing the inverter LED display. So let's get started. Um, you've got your net meter. Um, we just sent you the email saying go ahead and turn your system on. So you're going to come out to your, to your system and the first thing you're going to do is turn on your AC switches. So right here is our uh, solar AC disconnect. We're going to go ahead and, and flip that guy into the on position. Um, you know this thing's clearly marked uh, off and on. So we're going to go ahead and turn that on. And as soon as you turn that on you're going to notice that the inverter LED display will uh, illuminate and, and light up. Um, and that's how you'll know that all of your AC switches are in the on position. It could be the case that you have uh, more than one AC switch. In this case, we've only got one. Your system could possibly have an additional um, AC disconnect. So all those AC switches need to be turned on and you will know that all of your AC switches are on by viewing the inverter LED display right there and it will be illuminated. If it's not illuminated, that means one of your AC switches is in the off position and it needs to be turned on. So once we get all of our AC switches in the on position and we see our LED display illuminate, we'll move on to our inverter switches and turn uh, the inverter switches on. Okay, you got two inverter switches. Uh, number one is this black um, switch on the front here. And you also have this red, um, toggle switch that's located uh, behind uh, the inverter cover to the to the side here. Um, so the first thing you're going to do is you're going to take this black um, disconnect switch and you're going to turn that switch on and then you're going to come over to the red uh, toggle switch located behind the inverter cover on the left here. It's kind of hard to see, but you need to know it's there and you need to make sure it's on because if it's not, the system won't uh, produce power. So you'll see this one and zero here. So the zero is the off position and the one is the on position. Um, so right now that red switch is kicked over to the right uh, it's in the off position. So to turn it on, all we do is pull it over to the left or the one, and that's the, the on position. So um, it's very clear that the um, zero position to the right is off. I can push it over to the right. That's the off position. So to turn it on, you need to pull it over to the left to the one. That would be the on position. It's very uh, clear. I pull it over to the left. The one position is on, okay? Um, so once we put all of our switches in the on position, um, you will notice that the LED display will start to flash. And what's happening is, is the inverter, once the, all the switches are put in the on position, that the inverter goes through a wake-up cycle. Um, it'll do this every time that the inverter is turned on from the off position. It will also uh, do this every morning when the system first starts to wake up when it senses enough sunlight. It'll go through this five minute wake up cycle when you will see the inverter LED display flash and the wake up cycle and the flashing will last about five minutes. After that five minute wake up cycle and flashing, you should see that LED display stop flashing and you should see that green LED light turn solid. Um, a solid green LED light means power production. If you don't see that LED display stop flashing and that green light turn solid, that means that your system is not producing power, which means it's not working and we need to get the system working. So the first thing to check would be to make sure all my switches are in the on position. If you see the inverter LED display lit up, you know all your AC switches are on. The 
black switch is clearly marked off and on and here we are on the on position and then you just need to double check that red inverter toggle switch uh, behind the cover here make sure it's pulled over to the left to the one position that's the on position um, so if all the switches are in the on position after that five minute wake up cycle you should see the inverter led display stop flashing and you should see that green led light turn solid which means power production if you don't see that um, you need to check all your switches make sure they're on and if it continues to flash even if all the switches are in the on position you need to contact us and um, we'll get we'll, we'll find out uh, what system you know parameter needs to be addressed because um, if you don't see a solid green LED light the system isn't producing power and, and we need to get it figured out for you and we will if um, you have any you know uh, issues with that you just give us a call you email uh, email us and we'll get it figured out for you um, very quickly